Podcast Ranger. Ba, 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 Welcome to Extra Extra Cast Ranger, everybody. I'm not putting any of that yeah, in. Yeah, you are. Um. Mr. Oh, we leave everything in. That was the Dog of Wisdom, our special guest for today. How are you, Dog of Wisdom? Ha! Oh, I see. I see everything. Ah, he's praising Shin Godzilla on Blu ray. Out oh, now. Okay, in all seriousness, yes, hi, I'm Yolo Caster. I bought Shin Godzilla. Did you say Yolo Caster? Yo! 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 Yeah. Now you gotta do it. <laughs> Welcome to Extra Extra Cast Ranger. It's uh, 4 or 5 tonight because Raven is a uh, baby daddy. He's doing the, the dad duties. The, do the daddies. I have mucus build up in my left ear. It's unpleasant. That is news. Yeah. I just drove to Caledon and back. Oh, fun. In Caledonia? How no. far was that? Uh, I, was t I spent a total of two and a half hours driving. <laughs> Well, you have way more experience with driving than that. Through a fucking heavy rain situation. Why did you do that? Were there just people because yelling shit? Hugh Mementos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's get into our news. <laughs> Grass. I'm also Tastes here. Bad. That style like Emily was going, oh! <laughs> no, not the news! No, 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 that's not. No. First, I'm gonna drink this Pepsi. It's well, I'm Pepsi. gonna drink water, because that's better for you. Well, it's gluten free. If I was interested in what was good for me, I wouldn't be here right now. You know what's oh. funny? Emily will get a kick out of this. <laughs> like we ha at my work, we have like, like uh, our coffee station where like all our coffees are. But then we have hot water, and like under each all the coffee signs, like where it shows the name of the uh, type of coffee it is, it shows like, the calorie count. But hot water, it just says hot water, zero calories. <laughs> As if people don't already know that. But do you guys have just hot? Yeah, I wish you had just hot. It's, it's just steam. In you. I'm sorry. Um, first thing that I think is worth mentioning is a couple days ago on the on our Facebook page, I put up an image of the new Reaper skin from Overwatch, which looks like his own version of Laser Turbo. I put up that image with the gamer driver on it, and that thing has kind of gone a little bit viral. We got, like... 26 new likes on the Facebook this week and a few new Discord joins. Hooray for us stealing something from Blizzard and making and, and just slapping something from Toei off of it. Yay! I gave them $70. I think I can use it. <laughs> fucking had to buy 70 boxes for that fucking loot skin. Yeah, and I was in the room when you finally got it. You screamed. I did. Like I, he I heard it while I was watching The Matrix. <laughs> also, my, uh, also, sorry to get sidetracked quickly, but, uh, yeah, when you were laughing earlier, Ichi, yeah. I was talking to my parents on the phone. My dad was like, is that a dog in the background? Because <laughs> he sounds like a dog. <laughs> Certainly not one of wisdom. <laughs> okay, that's my fault. <laughs> um, before we get into the actual news. I'm like just here watching everything. I, I just wanted to quickly mention um, Strega who people might know is the current project of Garage Hero TV, the guys who made Gun Caliber. Uh, they are about to launch the Indiegogo for their for the second movie, for Strega, which is going to be happening on August 25th. So Ooh. if anyone is interested in supporting, basically, Gun Caliber 2, uh, check out Garage Hero TV's information. Why would they start an Indiegogo now when they've already started filming? Don't ask me. It's not my project. That's true. That, that, that seems kind of... Bueno, if you ever listen to this, my my deepest apologies. <laughs> that seems kind of back ass backwards. Would would we would you even go far as to say East No Bueno? East No Bueno. <laughs> Hi Blaze. How's it going, buddy? We uh, love you. 
Oh yeah, we have our Discord open, so we have yeah one, we one listener. His even, name is Blaze. Even though we're not doing any uh, guests over Discord, we just I just decided he's, to keep this opening for people to listen to the live. He recordings. says he's pretty good. That's, Hooray! I'd say that's pretty good. <laughs> Glad you're doing okay, Blaze. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna every t- when, as long as I remember to, we'll be keeping the Discord open when we record, which is usually Fridays between around nine or ten o'clock. Damn right, East, Eastern Standard Time. <laughs> No, no, no we can have fans in other time zones. <laughs> Meanwhile, somebody in somebody in the UK. Ah, fuck! <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I missed it. No. Right, I was Australian. We're gonna lose it. Oh, crikey! <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Actual news time. I got Vegemite all stuck in me bean. Oh, I know how you feel, oh. boys. Come on. Oh, 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 me easy. Ooh, I want to talk me, about me, it. Me. No, Gar can talk about it. I have no idea. Put your hand up first. Oh. How about you both say it at the same time and we'll see how far we get. Okay, one, two, three. Colorado Hay State Generation's final poster and release date revealed. revealed. Nailed it. Jinx! (laughs) Well, keep going, both of you. Okay, Uh, so uh, first official poster release date of Colorado Hay State Generation's (laughs) final. Okay. The upcoming Colorado X8 and Colorado Bill crossover film has been revealed. All right. Uh, there was a rumor going around. Which I have in a post, in 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 one of my next posts. I have, I actually have it written down. Okay. In my Google Drive. Well, let's talk about the actual, what we know for sure before we talk about the rumor. All right, let's talk about the poster quickly. It's got X8, it's got build on it. And, and then and some writers in the background. Three mystery men in the back. From the looks of it, Black RX, one's definitely Decade, I but there's so. one more silhouette. Wait, Ichi. I thought you were going to say three, one's definitely dead. Three, <laughs> mis- three mystery men, so you ghost. say. Yep. Which one's from mystery men are they? The, the Captain men? Hammer. Yeah. Is there Captain Blue, Hammer? Blue Raja. Blue Ra- and, uh... Invisible Boy or whatever? No, it uh, was... Uh, I always forget his name. Um, um, the guy who voiced Alex the Lion in Madagascar. The bit's dead. Moving on. Ben Stiller? So, ben Stiller. That's right, right, name. right. Um, so it's called Heisei Generations Final because technically this is the final time the two Heisei series will cross over. And, yeah. and what... Because Build is the last Heisei series. Yeah. The series after Build will be the I first know, rider of a new era. But because the Emperor of Japan is changing. In 2019. Yeah, Build is 2018, so the series after Build will be the new era. Yeah, but there will still be like a good few months of Kamen Rider in the Heisei era. So would he technically qualify as the end of the Heisei era? The eh. 20th season? I think the idea is the majority of build will be in the the major like the majority of the new next rider will be in the new era so what i'm excited about this movie if, is because if you think about it black rx technically happened during heisei but they call it a show a series so the shin zato and jay exactly what, what i'm excited most about this movie is that like we're probably going to have all the past heisei riders in this uh, movie. like kuga to ghost i got i actually got a list of Actors who are that are rumored coming back. Okay. All right. Whoa. All right. So here's a. Yeah, I have a. I have a better one written down. Okay. All right. So this is the current plot for the film right now. Common writers of the Heisei era are suddenly taking, or are, are suddenly taken into the other world. The where, non-specific other world. Just yeah, it's one a, of it's those just other a void. worlds. It's hell. Whichever. Yeah. Where a mysterious writer calling himself Grand Rider challenges all of them. For the title of strongest Heisei Kamen Rider. Uh, we're Spoilers, getting it's mother- Narutaki. We're getting a motherfucking tournament. Wait, Narutaki's gonna be the Grand Rider? I can see it happening. Oh, please bring back Narutaki! No, it, you know what needs to happen? It would explain why he's always been around. And you know what else needs to happen? Foundation X needs to be involved. Because what the fuck did they end up doing? Absolutely Oh yeah, you nothing. told me. Um, Alright, you know, uh, some notes for the film. It says, the film will feature legend rider forms for all the main Heisei era riders, such as Ku- Kamen Rider Kuga slash Agito form and Kamen Rider Kiva Drag Redder form. So they're going to get legend rider powers of each other. No, it's Build's gimmick. It's going to be like rider. No, no, no. Like, from what? Legend rider forms for all of the main Heisei riders. Yeah, so Kuga, which... Agito form. So it's. Akito form of Kuga. I think it. I think what it meant to be like what's meant to be is that Build will get the abilities of 
legend riders, no, and he would get new forms based on But the on thing them. is, we already know that each rider is going to be one set of two bottles because of the way the double and exe bottles are. This one says Kuga Agito form, which means it's Kuga Agito form. It's not build Kuga then Agito wh- form. Then why the hell is Kiva getting a form from Ryuki? I don't know. Because they're mixing it up. It's Heisei. They're going to mix and match all of them. Exactly. So it would make more sense... If it means that Build will get these powers and make forms out of them, but yeah, well, but it doesn't see. but it doesn't match up with the this the is in, this is some guy translating this. Okay, and this anyways, is all still rumored anyway. Yeah, it's yeah. all rumored. So, anyways, a uh, veteran actor is coming back. Kento Hamada, aka uh, Takami. Kento Honda. Yeah, Kento. Fies. Yeah, uh, Takami, comrade Fies. Uh, Takayuki Subaki. Blade. Yeah, Kenzaki. Hiro Mishiz. Or Hiro Mizushima, Mizushima Kabuto Tendo Soji Oh yes. that would Koji Seto As Wataru Kiva Yeah Masa 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 Hiro Inu Inoue 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 Decade Yep yeah. uh, Ren Kiriyama Double Joker Shotaro Yeah uh, Shun Watamabe Oz It's yeah. Watanabe Watanabe Sorry You're yeah. the least qualified To read names I'm sorry no my, no my voice is Like Yeah All up uh, yeah, Gakusano. Gaim. Yeah, Kota. Takuchi Ryoma, Drive. Yeah. Takeuchi. Whatever. Ryoma Takuchi as Tomari Shinosuke. Yep. 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 Shu Nishime as Ghost. Onuma Tenkuji Takudu. Because yep. we needed him. And for some odd reason, Tom Fujite. Fujita. Yeah. Amazon Omega. Haruka, yeah. Oh. Yeah, well, that was a surprise. That. Spoilers, Kabuto will win. So every so every title Heisei Neo Heisei rider except for Forze and Wizard. Wizard. <laughs> Wait, what what happened to Wizard? Forze got really popular in his career, like extremely. That you know they don't want and Wizard, overcrowd. And, and Wizard it, had one no. too many donuts. As we've been saying, Wizard. Had I too still many don't donuts. understand that joke. Because his face looked chubby when we saw him in uh, the X A Ghost. Yeah, oh, yeah so, you haven't seen that yet. Someone wants to. Say you don't know you don't see, you haven't seen Fat Haruto yet. <laughs> Shut up, stop it. Uh, the fandom is calling him Debuto. Oh I don't know God, if they are. I just made that up. <laughs> Debu is the word for that. Yeah, I, I know. Uh, yeah. So those are rumors. I hope they're true. And then some. And speaking of what we can confirm, there was a spy shot showing Brave, Fantasy Gamer level 50, fighting Hyper Kabuto. Oh, um, he's gonna get destroyed! Oh. Hyper Kabuto's the most oh. broken thing in Rider, period. Here's the thing. It's safe to say that they're ramping up. He's probably gonna level up into Legacy Gamer no. 100 during the fight. E- even so, Ichi. No, no, I'm on your side. I, I trust you. Even level 100 stands no chance against the man who can rewind time! Hyper Clock Up is busted. Broke. Aren't they currently fighting a guy the, who can The thing that? is, because Kabuto's not the focus of the movie, the, it's probably he's gonna hold back and like not use his full powers against him. Oh, that's gonna be bullshit. You know, like every other time a but, previous but, rider reappears. Just, so, uh, who, does, is it usually the most recent rider who wins? Just is the focus. Can I can I actually say something? Oh, sorry. No, no, what, no, what am I gonna say? No. Maybe. Okay, oh, I actually say it. He's say it. All right. Baby. Uh, so. Yeah, that quick plot synopsis that we just... That rumored plot synopsis that we got for Heisei Generations finale. Final. Yeah, final. It kind of reminds me of a fanfic that I wrote <laughs> back in high school. They are listening to us! <laughs> in which, basically, I watched every Heisei series from Kuga to Kiva actually listed every rider that is still active, and they all had a battle royale. Who won? Uh, the winner would have been Kuga and... It is the ultimate showdown! Yeah, guess ultimate this, it's destiny. like... The end would be the secured... Like, the end would be the guard. And if you ever... The bro- end would be a shitty guard. No, but Decade would be like the final boss. Like, he would come down and be like, Oh yeah, thanks for gathering everybody's powers for me. Now I'm gonna whip your ass. The end would be a shitty guard. He'd just steal everything and bail. Well, no, this is like <laughs> an AI the end. No. Oh. He would be the executioner. If you break the rules, you die from him. You get okay. data drained in the face. Th- thinking about th- thinking about realistic terms, though, in terms of like the actors coming back, Decade definitely will because he always likes coming back to reprises. Decade. Same with Shotaro. Uh, and Shotaro always loves coming back because hey. he loves Common Rider. Koji is actually a decent. Like he hasn't been back since um, Decade. No, Wizard Forze. 
What's Kiva in that one? Oh, did I? Did I say the wrong name? You said Seto Koji. Did you mean Decade? No, I meant... Se- Sorry, I meant to say uh, Watanabe. Oh, O's. Yeah. He hasn't been around since the uh, double... Or not double O's. Uh, Wizard 4 is a crossover. Ultimatum. Yeah. It's my favorite writer crossover movie. So... Whatever is happening, Hasty Generation's final looks to be fun times. This, yeah, no, this is probably going to be a fucking awesome movie. <laughs> it's going to be such fan service. It better be the swan, uh, the swan song of the of these crossovers. Like, like it I don't, has to be I don't like think the, they'll stop doing crossovers. They'll just stop calling them Hasty. Yep, they're going to do it exactly like they did with Pretty Cure, where they said All Stars is over. Now it's called New Stage. So, it's yeah. Like so, question: thing. What's the Hasty era? Like the next era? Well, it hasn't been, because if you really think of it, the emperor took a Chinese, from what I understand, Chinese lettering to make the make the word Heisei. Oh. So it could be whatever his son wants it to be. Oh, it's not this will be the Canada era. Yeah. No, it's a Showa era period. It was named after the emperor. Okay. Just with the Heisei so, era, so he they, completely so different. Person. Whoever the emperor was for the Heisei era just decided on the name Heisei. Yeah, hang on, go. No. Quickly pulled up while you guys. History lesson! Yeah. Next story! Sorry. <laughs> Not Heisei Godzilla. Speaking of movies, Kamen Rider Exe, true ending, opens at number two in the box office. Damn right. Behind Despicable Me 3! Yeah. Hey, hey, in that case, it's number one, you know, Toei, Toei movie. Think of it that way. Despicable Me is ridiculously popular in Japan as well. It, it's. Fucking every, every ch- child loves minions. Although it did beat uh, Transformers The Last Night and the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure movie. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Film cult currently holds a 92.2 satisfaction level rating, rating among audiences. And, yeah. s- and speaking of the movie, I have actually seen and obtained and saved for later an actual synopsis of the movie. Because there's been a lot of talk about how it actually fits into the ending of the series. So when the series ends, we will talk about that. Have people seen the series ending? Well, no, but people have seen the movie. That's why I have the synopsis of the movie, and we'll talk about that after we finish the series. Okay, so Mm. is it the true ending? I don't know yet. I haven't even read the thing myself. Oh, fair enough. I'm going to be just as surprised as everyone else. Okay. All right, next. Sorry for the question. Oh. Dr. Mighty Double X Gash. Oh. Oh my god. Formal release announcement. This Lane and I have already oh, pre ordered okay, these. Okay, here it is. Oh, uh, history lesson. Yeah, according to Obuchi, the name Heisei was taken from two Chinese history and philosophy books, namely Records of the Grand Historian, Shiki, and Classic of History, Shoyoki. In the Shiki, the sentence. Oh boy, that's a lot of Chinese. You want me to try reading this? Yes, please. Uh, I'm illiterate. I am terribly sorry. The sentence, Ne Ping Wa Cheng. I could be mispronouncing that terribly. Uh, Uchi Tairaka Ni Soto Naru. That. So, okay, I'm kind of right. It's from it's from Chinese. That's all that you need yeah. to know. Anyways. China. Dr. Mighty Double X Cash It. It's oh. pretty. By combined both meanings, Heisei is intended to mean peace everywhere. Okay. That's it. Damn Neo Peace Everywhere era. <laughs> ne- Kamen Neo Rider peace. peace Everywhere Generations. Final. Back <laughs> on, back the on peace final will peace. end, yes. Final Peace Everywhere. Back on topic. Dr. Mighty Double X. Uh, <laughs> no. This gadget's amazing. I love it. It's got both their voices. Car didn't like the x episode. Why? I'll oh, get I'm tomorrow. sorry. That'll, that'll happen. <laughs> um... But this sketch it's fucking amazing because literally the voice for it is both Kyria and Dan. And it's just... No. No. It makes sense, Gar, because they both created it. When did they have the time? You watch them do it in the episode. Dan is a genius game designer and he makes these gashets. He knows how to make one from scratch. We'll, we'll talk about why that doesn't make sense in the episode discussion, but in the meantime, we're talking about the release of the toy. And so, like the, we can see through the official images that the actual display on the gashet between the level X and double X forms is laser, turbo, and Genmu's forms 
which is cool because we never got to see like the game display of what Laser Turbo is. Tell about, tell about. And then the double X version is uh, a pill border around Exaid Muteki Gamer because it's designed for his use. This actually really fixes a lot all my problems with the Mighty Brothers gadget because I wanted like the double gadget, but I didn't like the colors on Mighty Brothers. But this actually I really like. So yeah. I'll be able to I'll be buying this that way I have both the dual and double style of gadget because I got the beta as well. Yeah, no, but this thing's great. We are, we heard the sound effects for it. And they it's actually just, published it's, them on the website, yeah. so I have high quality rips of the sounds. And it's fantastic. If anyone wants them, I have them in my sound collection. I can link. It's just the twin so same song. The granddad gadget. <laughs> the premium it's Bandai cool. Web exclusive. Uh, 2700 yen, December release. Uh, pre orders for the item end on August 31st, so make sure to get your prescription in. That was good. Or else, <laughs> or else the uh, Game virus will. Now I need to you. see a doctor. <laughs> no, ah! no, no, don't Now I need a surgeon. <laughs> no. You're not even worth it. I need an unlicensed radiologist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I'm dead. I need a coroner. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, moving along. Speaking of a coroner, Hayato Onozuka, who plays Kiria, was uh, recently in a publicity video for PlayStation VR. Cool. Okay. So, he, uh, he plays Farpoint and Winning Eleven 2017 for PSVR in this video. What so. is with PlayStation with that gun? Well, that's how you play shooters with it. It's like, it's like Link's crossbow training. I mean, yeah, oh, but that man, at that least is... looked like a like crossbow. That that just looks like two pieces of pipe. <laughs> <laughs> no, literally. It's links to PlayStation of VR. Go it's just the two first pieces game. of pipe. It literally looks like a, a piece of pipe. It's just an just accessory for the PlayStation Move controller. Yeah. Doesn't even look finished. If you really give a shit about that, then you can. I'm sure there's like a custom Se fan made version you can buy. Buy PlayStation better. VR. Yeah. Out now. Second, isn't this technology dated now? Not VR. Like the move. Yeah. No, the, you use the move in VR. It's it's like part of some games. The move was just Sony's attempt at trying to copy the Wii's motion controls, and nobody gave a shit about it because the Wii did it first. Pretty much, actually. So oh, yeah. Hi, Overkill. Hi, Dave. Oh, so, yeah, yeah, if you want to see uh, Laser play some VR games, then there's a video out. Next. The, the actress playing Build's main heroine is apparently actually a ninja. Why, why, why That's share, pretty amazing. Why, why share it out with the world? Oh, yeah, now that she's hidden. You know, she ninjas. Around, yeah. Hidden. Yeah, but she's uh, hidden in plain she, sight. She's in a ninja. She's in a ninja. <laughs> she's a ninja who doesn't hide. <laughs> <laughs> Triggered! <laughs> stop slapping me! <laughs> okay, stop it. You guys are sla you I'm sorry, that's, that, that's Gar's trigger me. word. He, he, he hates the ninja. What if I call them the Nignars? Yeah, I was thinking of that too. The Nignars? The Nignar. <laughs> Anyways, Kaho Takeda, who plays Misora Isurugi on the on Final Rider Build, was the winner of the 2014 National Ninja Champion Competition. Sadly, we might not see some of her ninja skills in the series as her job is to purify the harmful components of the SMASH! I still can't get Everybody, smash. everybody get up, send a smash now. Alright, next. Kamen Rider Deno Rider Ticket 10th Anniversary Collection. Oh. Do you like Imogens and tickets for the Deno Pass? Yeah. Then Jesus Christ, do we have a product for you. <laughs> Look at that picture yeah, again! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hover the card over a child's head and absorb their thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> the blades look. It, it was, requires his, the power. It looks like he's bloated in his face. It, it looks, looks like, like he's like actually getting his soul sucked out. <laughs> it requires the power of children to work. I love that kid's face. <laughs> like I think every single Imogen ticket that was ever in Deno anything is in this collection. So the set includes various rider tickets used in the series and its films, includes special tickets that reveal the imagine and time period once the card is placed near a victim's head? So that actually does that? Chances are by body temperature. 
You, you put it on someone's head and it reveals the imagine. Oh my god. It has to be that specific hey, child, hey, though. Gar. He is the victim. You must blow your mind now <laughs> yeah. to know that Ultraman Orb was in Denno. He was Kai. He was the final yeah. villain in, in Denno. Wait a minute, he was Kai in Denno. And he was He's also guy that, in Orb. He was yeah. also that nerd in uh, Death Game Park. And guy... Guy and Kai. That, that, no, that, want, yeah, that child is the, the victim. The name, it doesn't say any Sorry. person. It just says the victim. So it has to be that specific child yeah. or else so, that won't happen. So the set comes with 88 standard cards, 6 foil cards, 32 changing cards, special booklet, and a binder. Jeez, this is now starting to remind me of the episode of Foster Song for Imaginary Friends where Blue just goes crazy over baseball cards. So this oh. premium Bandai web exclusive no, set me. costs ten thousand yen, so a hundred dollars on the dot before shipping and markup and customs for a December release. I'll take a, a no, please. Like as cool as it sounds, they don't do anything. Well, except for the thirty-two that do. Yeah, collecting cards is so bogus. Gar, you literally spent almost a hundred dollars just on fusion cards. It even did. comes with like Sieg and like the Infinity ticket and and these ones that like. Forbid you from boarding the Denliner. That's great. Alright. That's cool. If you like Deno, buy them. You know what, actually? They'd be good as autograph pieces for, like, finding all the VAs yeah. of each Imagine. Oh, yeah. And then oh, just yeah, that would be cool. Signed. You do know I have an autograph from an Imagine, right? That's cool. Which one? Um, wolf, oh. the Wolf Imagine? Oh, Yama? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Cool. No, Yuki Hiro. He was in I it. have also met him. He was at Anime North. I also yep. met him. I also met him and got pictures with him, and then I lost my camera. Oh, I, I took pictures with him, but according to... I thought to you were going to say, oh, I found your camera! No, oh. <laughs> no uh, I got pictures with him, but according to Anime North, I can't show him online. So All right. Oh, Next. can I talk about this one? Sure. Yay. Uh, more SH figure arts got announced, in which it's Shocker. Shocker. Hey! Uh, basically, really shocking. Uh, renewal, uh, renewal Shocker grunts. In which one is the standard one that you see nowadays, the Mexican one. The Mexican one? I shit you not, apparently they're from Mexico. Apparently they're from apparently they're from America. <laughs> they're what? from the America or the American uh, base. In Mexico? Yes. Wait, what? The American base in I'm, Mexico. I'm sorry, I, I missed something. What? what? <laughs> apparently, no, no, apparently so Shocker far, Troopers are Mexican, okay. but they're also American. Oh, Sing! Uh. <laughs> okay, we just need the thumbnail for this episode to just be a shocker trooper with a sombrero and no! like one of those Pedro mustaches. No! And just the not... name of the episode is Sing! No! Run. Key. Don't do it! And then the, the back and the background is the red guys, or as Tom and I call them, Flamios. Oh, you mean the original shocker grunts? If, 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 anyone, if anyone wants context on that, watch our videos of when we play Comrade or Battle Ride War. Yeah, uh, yeah. Also, <laughs> the one that surprised me the most is Gel Shocker Grunts. Is that the X-Man looking fucker? Yes. No, the uh, biggest at, one is... So at the very end of Kamen Rider, Shocker became Gel Shocker. Okay. Why so, gel? Because the old one didn't gel with fans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so in which uh, they became Gel Shocker, in which those are the current Grunts. But then, a uh, great shocker leader. Uh, figure art. A.K.A. cracked egg on red cape. Um, <laughs> he better come with a snake head. head. Yeah, I'm like, his head, that head turns into a cobra. No, Makes well, sense no, that no, it's an egg no, then. It's, it's Ku Klux Klan mask. Because they're neo-Nazis. Sna no, then snake head. Then that. Oh, okay. Then Illuminati. And then nothing. Yeah, his head does look like an egg. <laughs> no. Let's crack this egg. Let's see Get what kind of dangerous. snake I can be! First we crack the shell, then we eat the yolk inside! Great leader, great leader, if he's our man, he can't do it. Great! <laughs> Shocker! <laughs> Three years, so miss you, Robin. Uh, in, in addition, Ambassador Hell's monster form, Gara Garanda and Gel Shocker. <laughs> can you say it again, please? Gara Garanda, not helping the Mexican thing. <laughs> hey, Gara Garanda! No. Hey. I'm sorry, Mexico. Gel Shocker's great you. leader and Gara Garanda will also, <laughs> will also get their own SH Figure Arts figures as well. 
Details the, such as uh, price and release dates of these figures are yet to be announced. One of these, I, it, it's, one, it's moments like this that I wish we just had a fucking acoustic guitar so we just go. Chupacabra! I'm really, really. El Nino! Hang on. I'm go really get my sorry, guitar. Mexico. <laughs> well, yeah. No, I'm glad that there are more shocker uh, figure arts. Are you gotta gotta add about it? <laughs> Hey, it's Gar. He's Gara Galad. Yeah. Gara Galad. <laughs> yeah. You know what? That's the episode name. Okay. I'm sorry. That was stupid. Okay, the thumbnail's still a shocker trooper with a sombrero and a mustache. Are you sure yep. it can't be me with a sombrero? No. Aww. Shocker trooper with your face and a sombrero. Yeah, we already put you on Godzilla's fucking... With Yellowcaster's face. Uh, yeah. There you go. Wait, that was Gamera. Yeah, that was Gamera. Yeah. But no, it's just... Did and we then, put Donald Trump on Godzilla once? I think we made jokes about Trump. And then again, who hasn't made jokes about Trump now? I'll tell you who okay. hasn't. Kamen Rider Skull, because the Skull Boiler has been announced. Yeah. Skull! Did you all like my seamless yeah. ass segue? Yeah. That's a cool hat. <laughs> what? He's, yeah, You're he's right. The, he's the only Kamen Rider that wears a fedora, and he wears it super awesomely. The only uh, Rider who wears a fedora so far. Like... Kamen Rider Skull is on his own separate tier of just greatest rider ever because is he's it just because so he's badass. Based on Skull Man, he, he's the only sure? he's the only person, real or fictional, who's still allowed to wear a fedora and still be cool. What about Indiana Jones? Indiana Jones isn't a rider. <laughs> he's got you there. Or he should he? be. Just henshin. Just like he henshins, <laughs> just like uh, Kamen Rider Skull, who like does the whip around with the belt. Lock on. Yeah, that's like his standby time. That would actually be cool. Okay, Premium Bandai announces the SH figure to release of Skull's Rider Machine, the Skull Boilder. Which really doesn't make sense when you think about the name, because Doubles was called the Hard Boilder because he was all about being hard boiled. But if Skull came first, naming his bike the Skull Boilder seems kind of out of order. Well, maybe, maybe Narumi, Sokichi Narumi thought he was Skull Boiled. <laughs> I mean, did you ever think about that? Okay, okay, Lane, there are some What's, be what's better than even, hard... Even you know that's bullshit. What's better than hard-boiled? Skull-boiled. No. Scalding hot-boiled. He, 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 he eats skull-boiled eggs for breakfast. So... They're like hard-boiled eggs that yeah, he skull Yeah, skull he, skull boil, he boils the eggs in his skull. It's no, that's stove. not what I was thinking. He just cracks it on his skull. Gar just wants to... Like, I can <laughs> see in Gar's head, he's just beating the shit out of me in his head, just... No! No, Lane! Uh, um, uh, uh, excuse me. Yes. Um, Blaze has a really good point. If Indiana Jones was a rider, he better hope he doesn't run into Shocker's snake leader. <laughs> oh. It's always snakes. <laughs> snakes. I'm sorry, I'm everyone. Snakes. How do they hide with their whole body? Scarfits! No, they just, like, two of them lay on top of each other to form a swastika. Great, now I'm just thinking about G.I. Joe. Hey! The best they probably get hey, Kobe. How yeah. much is this gonna be, G? The Skull Boilder figure That's a cool picture. Which I'm sorry about that. Which includes stand parts, uh, which is also being, it will be the perfect pair for the renewal skull that's releasing in August. The Skull Boilder is priced at 5184 yen and release March of next year. Is there God. a set coming out with the bike and the rider? Probably. Uh, as much as there should be, it does not appear so. Well, that's a waste. Skull's coming out in August. His bike is not coming out until next March. I wonder if there's just a... That's good I'm planning, Hokage. I wonder if there's just a... Walker. I, just, I wonder if there's just a bigger collector that just only collects the bikes. Like, he's like, I'm not interested in the riders. I like the bikes. No, if no. you're someone who only collects the bikes, come on our show. No. Message us. Yeah, but there are I people who collect... Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, there's a picture of Kamen Rider Ichigo in a coffin. Yes, Hitler's treasure. Kamen Rider. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I love... I love... When I'm Nazis are mentioned in Kamen Rider. Now you get to put that image in. Oh, I already have that picture. I bet you do. I've had that since Hitler's 2015. Treasure. I've had Hitler's treasure since high school. Next, oh, and most excitedly, oh. the Kamen Rider double Futo Detectives manga has not only been released, for, uh, chapter one, but scanlated already. G goodbye. It's like goodbye. Hitler versus, versus Hitler versus Gartler. Goodbye. Gone. Bye. Can you tell Gar isn't a fan so far? Of, he just, of what? This is like, okay, the entire first chapter is just Shotaro. It's set up. 
fill up talking about boobs. That's not it! It's in one frame! I thought he liked boobs. <laughs> Guess not. I, I, I genuinely just thought... Just fill up research boobs. Yeah, I, I, so, found, so. I find them so fascinating, I got them myself. You just, like, see the word opi written in large on his chalk whiteboard? Sh Wait, Shotaro, really touch them! Wait, did that really happen? No. No. There was an epi there was Let, an no, you know, let's not spoil anything that happens in it. No, no, I'm talking about people, the manga. No. No, I know. Let's not spoil what happens in it because people might want to read it. I'm just we're just here to and you brought Kool-Aid. I was talking about the That's show. I was talking about the time that Philip researched pastries and then he got fat because he ate too many. Oh yeah, but anyways. Turtle! Don't you turtle me. Turtle! Uh, I'm turtle. really confused now. Yeah, I know. More, more so, so than I was like two seconds yeah. ago. So, so anyways. Now. Uh, the series is being translated by uh, Solar Wings and being distributed by OZC, the same group that re-releases various Toku shows in Blu-ray quality. Uh, so heads up for anyone who doesn't know, who didn't pay attention when we talked about it before, the seri the double manga apparently features partial nudity and gore. Cool. It has partial nudity and partial gore? Yeah, half of Half and half. Oh. <laughs> As you can hear from Gar's silence, he, uh, he loves this manga a lot. Uh, I got I got ten pages in and I gave up. Why do you dislike? The first chapter is set up. It's an ongoing series. Doesn't help when the first ten pages consist of just. Anyways, uh, yeah, go read it. And depending on the availability of certain cast members, we may or may not be following through on our previously mentioned idea about doing a voiceover for that. Turtles happy. We are, we are in. We are in. We are in talks. We'll figure that out. I don't know. It sounds cool to me. Yeah. Turtles rocking out. Actually, did they announce who's replacing the Kermit the Frog guy? Yeah, they did. It's the same person who did Constantine. It's Matt Vogel. Oh, that's I mean, if anyone's gonna replace him, it should be that. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait! Like Constantine from CW's Constantine? No, no, Constantine the Frog. From Muppets Most Wanted. Oh, the. The Kermit look alike. Yes. The one who became Very medium good. as evil Kermit for some reason. Anyways, that's the news. Is your name bad guy? Bad G. Yeah. Oh man, that movie's so good and the first one too. We're doing a sequel. Well, we're we're back, back by popular demand. demand. Come, Come on, on everybody, strike, strike up the band. band. We're, we're doing, doing a sequel. Just that's we're... what we do in Hollywood. And everybody knows that the sequel's never quite as good. A sequel, as another featured attraction. Places, le er, places, please light the lights. Throw camera action. If there was okay. a camera, I'd be staring at it. <laughs> uh, Ash okay, we're done. Hashtag Hashtag that wasn't meant to go on as far as it did. I'm sorry. Hashtag everyone. Don't leave him hanging. Hashtag Dream uh, Yellow uh, Ship uh, Hardcore. Wait, what? Nothing. I heard the thing. <laughs> I heard a thing too. It's okay, guys. I don't want to upset anyone. <laughs> Anyways, that's like the news. juice. I bought Shin Godzilla. The whole thing? Yes, the whole thing. I own it! My <laughs> movie! Um, I literally bought my I paycheck. Was the guy I bought the entire himself. Ma I bought the entire <laughs> Matrix trilogy on Blu ray because I really like the Matrix movies. I bought Gal Gun VR. Oh my gosh! Yeah. I need to. I mean, no. Yeah, you can really shoot girls with like a gun that takes their clothes off. Not that doesn't take their clothes what? off. It gives them euphoria. Is the official description. Yep. Oh, it makes them horny. I see. Well, I mean, they come at you already. Anyways, let's get into the show. Show. Thanks for listening to our show. That's definitely about Tokusatsu. It's because no, a it's Cupid not. hits a guy, and there's like a whole backstory. Read the wiki. Frack so frack. Everybody run. He's gonna become an Ultraman. Says Blaze about um Gar. Since you own the kaiju. <laughs> Alright, bye bye! I'm sorry.